Hello, this is Lorenzo from Event Espresso, and in this video, I'll show you how to create a golf tournament in Event Espresso. If you're planning a golf tournament or a golf outing to raise funds for a local charity or perhaps a nonprofit group, then this video is for you. So let's jump right in. We'll go ahead and enter in a title. So we could say something like Annual Golf Classic. And now I'll drop in some details about this golf tournament so we can take a look, okay? So it's gonna take place on April 27th from 8 a.m. till 3 p.m. We also have pricing options for individuals as well as teams. And then we have some various sponsor options, okay? So let's go ahead and set up that date. So we'll use the date time selector and select April 27th and it's gonna start at 8 a.m. So we'll click on done. And then this will wrap up at 3 p.m. So we'll use the slider to move it back and then click on done. All right, so now let's go ahead and set up the first pricing option, which is for individual players. So we can scroll down and what we can do is just rename the existing one. And now let's adjust the sell until date. This is the date that the event will close. So let's say we want to wrap this up about a week before so that we can plan for the uh, golf tournament. So we'll click on done. And then we can set up the pricing, which was 100. For now, we'll clear the quantity. And what we can do to save a little bit of time is to actually duplicate this item a few times. So let's see, we have one, two, three, four, five, six more registration options. So we'll do one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so from here, what I can do is actually copy in the titles and replace some of these. So we'll go ahead and get all of these added and then we'll make some changes to them individually. So you're probably asking, why did I do this? Well, there are some similarities between the pricing options. For example, the sell until dates are all the same. So when we do it this way, it carries over some similar information so that we kind of get a jump on creating the things. And then afterward, we can go through and update the final details. Okay, so now we can go through and set up the pricing. So the golf sponsor is 150, beverage cart is 500, silver is 1000, gold is 3000, and platinum is 10,000. Okay, so that brings us to the golf team, uh, which is the foursome. For this one, we're actually gonna do something a little bit different. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna click on the gear icon here, which opens up the advanced settings. And because we want this to be sold as a set or a bundle, we're actually gonna set the quantity to four for the minimum and the maximum. And then we're going to set the price to 87.50. So basically 87.50 times five will equal the bundle for a team. And from here, what we can do is adjust some of the quantities that are available for the sponsorship. So for example, let's say there are 18 holes, so that's 18 sponsors, um, three beverage carts, three silver sponsors, five gold sponsors, and one platinum sponsor, okay? So we've just set up the registration options as well as the sponsorships. What I'm gonna do at this point is go up save the golf tournament as a draft, and now let's go check it out on the front end. So I'll follow that link. All right, and we'll scroll down. And here is what it looks like. So for example, if I was a sponsor for this event, I could select a sponsorship item and then click on register now. Or if me and my buddies wanna participate in the fundraiser, we could set up our team, you know, us, a group of four guys, and then get registered, okay? So that is an overview of how to create a golf tournament in Event Espresso. From here, what I would do is collect, connect the venue, uh, upload an image, um, add in some additional details about the golf fundraiser, such as who it's for, and then of course, update the event. All right, so thanks for checking out this video.